mozzarella cheese, mixed herbs, chopped garlic, mayonnaise, oil, green chopped onion, butter, milk, one and a half cup of all-purpose flour, one tablespoon of yeast, one fourth teaspoon of salt, one and a half teaspoon of sugar. So first we have to make the milk hot, then we have to pour it in a bowl. And then we add sugar. Then the salt. Then the yeast. As you can see, it just spread out so good. And then now we have to add the all-purpose flour. And then we have to mix. As you can see, I've mixed it well now. And now we have to make it into a ball and flip it over and then you add some oil. Just a little bit though. And now we have to cover it for one hour and let it rest. I'll show you how to rest it. So now I have covered it with plastic foil. So we have to keep it in a hot place for it to rest. And we have to like do this. and then keep it like this, so then it's warm. And now we have to cover it for one hour. Leave it rest. After one hour, the dough is ready. As you can see, it got, it got way bigger than before. Okay, so now you have to wear cooking hand gloves and remove the pa paper foil and take the dough, super sticky, and put it in here. So now we have put the dough in the baking tray and now we have to make it into a square shape. made this into a shape like this and now we have to take the butter and put it one spoon of mixed herbs one spoon mayonnaise the garlic And then the green, then the green chopped onions. Now we have mixed everything, put everything, now we have to mix it. So now we have mixed this well, and now we have to like do lines in the middle, and we have to keep one space and cut it, and also keep one space over here. And now we have to put this thing we have mixed everywhere. Now we have put the mixture on the dough and there, now we have to make like a line of cheese and then put it on in like the holes we made in the middle. So now the cheese bread is ready and we put the cheese in the line and we the cheese we had left over we covered it and now it looks so beautiful and my mouth is already watering 
So now let's put it in the oven for 20 minutes. So now we put it inside the oven and don't forget to put a heating glove always. Now let's close the oven. So now we put it in the oven for 20 minutes and I'm going to show you how it is after 20 minutes. After 20 minutes it's ready and I cut it and I did the plating like this. As you can see it's so thick and it's so cheesy. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe my channel. And if you have a request, don't forget to type it in the comments below. Bye!